tell me when we're ready. Uh -huh. She looks so serious. I know. So we have a set, I know, right? So we have a section here for diatherics, also known as ETL genetics, or this. It's got several of the numbers. The person that we're actually dealing directly with is this person right here, Bill Bright. Not B-R-I-G-H-T, but B-R-I-E-I-T. And he is our account rep representative. He, we've been dealing directly with him. Um, and of course, we got a laminated one. Woohoo! But there are several emails surrounding this. Probably the biggest thing you need to know is that we're trying to decrease our turnaround time by two or three days. So effective pretty much last night, we're sending everything that's being ordered right now to diatherics. Um, the, there's a test code, I think it ends. Yeah, I have the other information. COVIDD, and these are the acceptable media that can be used. So fortunately, we can still use the same medium and the same swab we're using currently from to go to Quest. Quest. Yes, so it's going to be great. the same type of kit that we're yeah. creating. That will be the same. So that will be the same. The uh, they'll have one pickup a day. Uh, the pickup will be between 9 and 10 in the morning. It'll be City Express, not a diatherics um, courier. The courier will take it eventually to Kennestone. At Kennestone around noon, it will leave there to go to Huntsville, Alabama. They'll be doing testing Monday through Saturday. There is no pickup on Sunday. You just leave the samples in the refrigerator until Monday morning and they'll be picked up then. Um, is there anything should we go talk about how to calculate the... Yeah, calculate all the supplies that we need to keep up with the tracking with all the supplies. So, here are the supply board. So, in the first column, we have blue boxes. The second column is the BCN media split, which means what we did this week was we split the three mils down into 1.5 mils. And when we go to the refrigerator, we'll show you what those look like. They actually allowed us to have, to double our inventory, which was great. We also had some unsplit kits. Those are the regular three mils. So we didn't split everything. We did leave some because you have other things that gotta go out like Legionella cultures and stuff like that. We do have so many for lesions. And then we, this is how many COVID tested we have pending. We do just update every day. This is how many swabs we still have left. And then um, this is um, how many diatherics kits we have left. And then the total, the total is actually this number right here. Yeah, right? the red, the uh, green. Well, I guess it would be the split and the unsplit, right? Yes, uh-huh. So, so the potential here is this number, this number, and this number equals to 59. But honestly, we have we have over 60 kits right now. We can we can send out the door, right? Right, that's correct. Right, we have 60 kits. So uh, we'll be updating that every day. Uh, please pay attention to this wall, especially we're making a video. Hi, Dr. Frank, we're making a video for the weekend team. Hi, hi. And you saw the latest from Julie about collection kits. Yes, I think yes, I had it yes, 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 yes. Uh -huh. We're very excited. Yes, yeah, very we excited to have other options. Yes, very excited. So um, we would like a kit uh, tally every day because I'll report it, be reporting that out to corporate. Um, always make sure, I said give out the diatherics first, but really we're just giving to diatherics, okay? That's what we're doing right now. Um, you can go ahead and print the SunQuest label and send it up to the floor when they ask for a kit. That way they label the sample with the SunQuest label. You don't have to get back into the bag. We asked them to do that for safety for you guys, okay? And um, just if there's anything that comes in from Quest, update on that, that on the supply board as well. Questions about dietherics? Turnaround time is 24 hours. Here's the pickup time. Here's where it goes. No pickup on Sunday. And um, today we are allowed VD, VCM media to be used. So, so remember, it will go to Keniston to be able to go to dietherics. Alabama and Huntsville. Yeah. So it's a little. Now we'll go over to the refrigerator. Yeah, refrigerator. All right. Say hi, everybody. You there, Bob? Yes.
inside, we have three boxes. This is the dietary box. But now we're kind of working on that. Actually, we can just media. say, yeah. Yeah, we're yeah. working on it. So all of the um, kits will be in here. But that's a, that's a recent medium the dietary is provided. That's provided the copan, Amy's medium with the polyester swab. But as alternative, we have the recent medium, which is yeah. red. It's split in 1.5 ml with the same swab, the polyester. So what, what of they did, swab. So what they did this week, where they were able to split them, and we doubled our inventory. Right. Great job. So we have more labels up front in case that you guys need to split some. When Dietherix comes to pick it up, this is where they would find their their specimens. All right. And it's, that, I think that's it. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Bye, everybody. <laughs>